Hey, uh, so my name is Helen He. I'm going to just go share a few words about the NWAYS to GPU Programming Bootcamp and beyond for NERSC. Next slide, please. First of all, I'd like to thank NVIDIA for bringing this bootcamp to the NERSC. Uh, I'd like to thank our organizers, Troy and Julia, wonderful um, instructor for, for the bootcamp, um, Robbie and other people, um, cluster support, Mantasa, Jeremy, and uh, many people worked on preparing materials, Mashka and Robbie and many others. And finally, 10 TAs for the day, um, Matt, Jonathan, Odette, Scott, Brent, Matt, Rojo, Brad, Whaler, and Kevin. So thank you all very much. Also thank all attendees uh, for your interest to learning GPU programming and use them on Perimeter and generate uh, producing wonderful science results in the future. So the majority of bootcamp attendees here today are NERSC users and some uh, Argon and uh, Oak Ridge users as well. Um, the topics today will cover basic programming concepts on GPUs and a survey of various programming models supported by NVIDIA HPC SDK. Um, after the bootcamp, when you lose um, the access to the cluster provided by NVIDIA, you should be able to use materials um, from today, the uh, Jupyter Lab or uh, CoLab, uh, with detailed um, instructions, explanations, and then run your GPU codes on Perimeter and, and I'll Summit, uh, Frontier, Aurora, and Polaris as well, and some other DOE systems. And lastly, I would like to point a few um, more in-depths for the from the past and upcoming NERSC training materials that you can learn on uh, each of these topics today that has presented today. Uh, next slide, please. I'd like to show you a quick table of the uh, GPU programming models supported on Perimeter. Uh, so uh, you'll learn five of them um, for five first, five, first five columns, uh, standard libraries and CUDA, uh, OpenACC, OpenMP, and CUDA, as well as for the CUDA C and CUDA 4chan from NVIDIA HPC. And um, you can see that we, we support uh, lots of programming models for GPU. We also have multiple compilers available on Perimeter. Some of them apply uh, provide by vendor, NVIDIA, and, and and by our vendor HPE. So we have Cray compiler, GNU compiler, and NVIDIA uh, compiler. We also have NERSC supported LRVM. You know, you may know also the name of Clan for C, it's C, C++ support. And Intel compiler is coming soon. Out of these, um, uh, for portability concern, um, seems OpenMP and standard parallelization, language parallelization are mostly portable because it's supported by all compilers. Um, it'd be, would like, I would like recommend uh, to start with these uh, if you are new to porting your application to, uh, to GPU. So that, that can be uh, working with different compilers and on different uh, HPC systems. Next slide, please. Here is a list of selected NERSC GPU training events. NERSC has a event training events page. On those, you'll find all the past training events and upcoming ones. And, uh, majority of them will have slides and recordings available. Recordings are posted on the NERSC uh, YouTube slash, uh, YouTube channel. Um, we have three-part OpenACC, nine-part CUDA, two-part standard C, C++ Fortran. We have um, NVIDIA HPC SDK and uh, the, the, and the tools and, and insights, system insight, compute profiling. Many of those are provided by NVIDIA, actually. And some of them are um, collaboration with Oak Ridge and Argon training. Uh, you can, <clears throat> um, I want also point out the GPU so for Science Day. Um, those events are, uh, we have a, a showcase of our um, NERSC science application teams with their real hands-on hands -on applications and tips to share with um, other users. So um, also point out um, some other training like hip and sickle and two tools, uh, proof tools and review tools to help you to insert OpenMP and OpenACC directives for GPU and CPU. And there's also another training uh, is, is Cody, which is upcoming. Next slide, please. It's another tool that help you to uh, 
to program for, for GPU by inserting uh, directives as well. Uh, it's, you can click on the link and register for the event. Um, um, also upcoming, uh, NERSC Open GPU Hackathon, again, organized by the wonderful people of the bootcamp <laughs> organizers. So this is a NERSC specific, although you can uh, apply and attend many other GPU hackathons uh, on the website as well, that you, you, would join in, you would join as a team and apply for that. And uh, it'll be four days of intensive uh, GPU, GPU porting. You have mentors assigned to each team. So it'll be a big boost for your application um, optimization. So check this out and apply for that. We are also having an, another advanced SQL training end of May. So these are what I have. So lots of lots of things you could uh, use and, and learn after this bootcamp. That's all awesome. I have. Awesome, thank you very much, Helen. Um, and I believe I did see a question come across in Slack very quickly. Um, um, Joseph Chan says, if I don't currently have GPU node hours on Perlmutter, can I request for them outside of my current nurse project as long as there's a science goal? Yes, yeah, yeah, you can apply for, for NERSC hours. We, we can chat uh, privately. There are some RCAP um, uh, NERSC director reserved hours you can apply for. You can apply for our initial uh, start up um, project, et cetera. Also depends on if you already have CPU hours, but 